it sounds like they were in the park to, to commit more crimes, and um, we, we were fortunate someone made that call. Purses and more than 35 ID cards were found on suspects that investigators say were preying on out-of-town visitors at Sequoia National Park. That is our top story tonight, live at 5. Good evening, I'm Liz Harrison. And I'm Warren Armstrong. Thomas Moore and Keeley Patrick are now in jail after Tulare County Sheriff's deputies say they were caught stealing from people at Sequoia National Park. Action News South Valley reporter Jessica Paris is live at Sheriff's headquarters in Visalia now with how investigators caught the accused thieves. Jessica? Warren, another visitor at the park, saw the suspects in a U-Haul acting suspicious. They also saw that a car near them had been broken into, so they called the sheriff's office to report it. People from across the world travel to Sequoia National Park in Tulare County to get a glimpse of some breathtaking views and explore nature. Most find themselves trying to protect their cars and food from bears and other wildlife. This past weekend, some tourists also found they had to ward off thieves, too. People get in here and they start thinking about vacation and they don't think about being the victim of a crime. So we do ask them to be really careful with their property. On Saturday afternoon, investigators say a person at the Indian Head parking lot near the entrance of Sequoia National Park spotted a car with a broken window and two people nearby in a U-Haul acting suspicious. Once authorities were alerted to the possible criminal activity, they spotted Thomas Moore and Keeley Patrick in Three Rivers and pulled them over. We were able to identify that one of them had numerous warrants from out of the area, that they were in possession of stolen property, they had identification from over 35 different people. Sergeant Douglas says the two also had stolen purses, backpacks, plus drugs and one was driving with a suspended license. Investigators aren't sure if all the stolen items were taken from tourists at the park. We did identify that some uh, visitors to our park had some things that were stolen and then uh, once we did make that contact and were able to search the vehicle we located additional items so we found that there were more victims than what we originally thought. The crime had some visitors spooked. It's shameful. It's, and it's so sad when people come to the national parks to just enjoy the natural beauty and so forth. You shouldn't have to be so worried about vandalism and, and thieves. Now, the suspects are not from the area. They're from Everett, Washington. They're now here in a Tulare County jail facing an array of charges. Now, investigators have the lengthy task of trying to get in touch with all the possible victims to see if they can get their property back to them. Live in Visalia, Jessica Paris, ABC 30 Action News.